Nothing like waking up to 61 degrees on a morning in November. It's the 15th, and it has to do with the Atlantic Ocean. We've got a strong Bermuda high. The Atlantic is very warm, but the Pacific is very cold, and it's getting colder in Canada even as it grows warmer in Texas. That means a battle royale is setting up. You saw about that storm in Alaska last week. Well, uh, that pumps warm air into the nation, but the cold is persistent. And it's going to dive down into the northwest. A series of snowstorms this week in the west. Alta, the Wasatch, the Tetons all picked up a foot of snow. Another foot of snow on the way there. We're going to get a brief dose of cold here for Thursday, Friday, making snow into the 19th. Some areas will be able to open. Uh, but then what happens over the weekend, subtle warming before uh, another more powerful cold shot comes through the Great Lakes. And then it's a real tough call for Thanksgiving week, but it looks like New England is going to be divided. At the south coast, near the Atlantic Ocean, it's still going to be warm enough for rain. But you get inland, this kind of high that's going to go right over us and just to our north could set up one of those uh, snow to ice to rain events for southern New England that could stay all snow in northern New England. That would be on Tuesday. And we're